What if there was one skill, one ability that you could hone that if you did, it would bring others to Christ? Well, there is, and that's what we're going to talk about today. There's one thing that you can do. You can make it a part of your life, so you're doing it consciously every single day. We're gonna hit the trail, it's getting close to summer. We're gonna talk about a metaphor between summer and this skill. Let's go. Summer is hands down my favorite season, probably because I was an altogether juvenile delinquent in school and just wanted the summer to come so I could break free. And there's a metaphor about summer, a proverb penned by King Solomon, the wisest man to live. The prudent person sees summer as an opportunity to harvest. When we observe someone ready to be plucked up for Christ, we seize the opportunity. So I don't know if you know this, but the skill to be able to capitalize, to be able to have the vision to capitalize on someone who is ready to be harvested, someone who is primed to be plucked, to tell about Christianity or to invite to church or tell them about God, that vision to be able to see when people are ready to be harvested, that is a skill. And you will find that it's only a minority of Christians that actually have that ability and you could become one of them. So as a Christian, if you want to adopt this visionary skill, you have to first adopt the mindset of Christ that observing a harvest of people for God's kingdom is like observing a harvest of food when you're hungry. Christ says that we sometimes wait entirely too long to capitalize, to invite someone to church or tell them about the Bible study we're a part of or interject spirituality into conversation to mention that we're Christian. He literally says, you need to open your eyes. You think it's still four months until the harvest? Take a look at the fields, they're ripe now. One skill that you can consciously practice and grow in that will make your life so much more fulfilling is the skill of looking through the lens of seasons and harvest to bring others to Christ. As you do, God will bless you and your vision will grow all the more acute. You'll be able to quickly see the seasons of harvest from either seeds planted by you or someone long before you. So like so much of the New Testament, it's not necessarily a difficult thing to do to learn to observe and to look for the harvest. But like so much of the New Testament, it's deliberate. It's trying to live a conscious Christian life and bring others to Christ. And I can think of nothing better to do in this life than develop the skill of observing those who are ready for the harvest. Because in the end, you develop that skill, you get to bring others into eternal life with you.